Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, it's me, Sapio. Uh, I have been gone for <laughs> quite a while and now I am back. I wanted to make another video, I don't know what to frickin' make. <laughs> so I'm gonna make a video about Minecraft and I'm gonna try to be as, as like interesting as possible, to be honest. I don't know how I'm gonna do that, but let's start with a fresh new map. And uh, let's uh, just uh, let's just play this. Like, um, I'm just gonna cut out all the boring long parts and try to be as natural as possible, whilst also being trying trying to remain uh, natural and uh, try to make something that's uh, per perhaps relaxing. And there will there will be music and such. And the uh, cue the music soon. Actually, by the way, there'll be music. So like the in the montage parts if i do if i decide to do a montage then you know there'll be music it's it's just it's one of my sapio videos as as you know that's just how it goes so uh, without further ado let's get into it so yes all right so we're going to okay so and let me bear with me a moment <laughs> Uh, I've got to look over these options here. Um, I'm going to have a uh, <laughs> uh, bonus chest because I'm freaking lazy. And the world type will be default. However, wait, wait, wait. Oh, what am I even doing? Jesus Christ. Let me name the world as... Uh, I don't know. Let's just call the world world. <laughs> this is so unoriginal. Sapio, World Sapio. All right, we can go with that. It's fine. You won't see the name ever again. It's, it's okay. Um, next, uh, need to. Uh, yeah, those that bonus chest. Okay, that's good. Now I can start. Now, excuse me one moment while I adjust these graphic settings. Jesus, like I, I, I don't know what happened. Like I think it's the the configuration file got set weird because recently, as you all know. The, uh, the um, seed for that uh, main menu map. The main menu map was discovered recently, and I went back to beta 1.7.3 to test that out. And I think that fudged some of my settings here, but no big deal. No biggie. No biggie. Well, let's just set some of the... <laughs> some of these parameters here. That's alright. Okay. So, mm -hmm. all right, now my game doesn't look like complete garbage. And of course, you gotta set your FOV. Ah, 90. 90 is a good FOV. Okay, where's that bonus chest? What the hell? There's an actual Mesa next to my. Oh my god! This is the best spawn ever! What the actual frick? Okay, but seriously, where's that bonus chest? You know, guys, it really shows when you're playing on a garbage monitor. Uh, I used to play on a 1 millisecond kind of monitor. 1080p, 1 millisecond. Oh, here's the freaking bonus chest I was looking for. Okay, but like I was saying, like, I've been playing for so long on a 1 millisecond monitor. And now, I'm playing on this garbage 22 inch 1080p, but 1080p 5 millisecond monitor. And, uh, blah, blah, blah. it's uh, kind of gross. It's not as nice. Okay. So, I got bees here. That's pretty interesting. That could be for a future project. But, however, I'm not going to... Um, I'm not going to do too many things all in one video. But, I'm going to actually do an hour-long video. This video is going to be an hour. As you can see. Or, hopefully. Hopefully, by the time I upload this and I... I've uh, done everything, then I'll have an hour-long video for you guys for you guys to watch. Um, yeah, because I find I find that it might be just more interesting to make hour-long videos and not just spam the inbox as much. Like I never really spam my inbox anyway. I've never been that way, but making uh, quality content is good. Okay, sorry, I was just kind of I cut there for a second because. I was like, am I actually recording? <laughs> Cause like if I wasn't recording and I was talking the whole time, I would I wouldn't want to kill myself. <laughs> but you know, uh, yeah, I don't usually spam my videos that much. Yeah, I don't spam videos that much. But okay, so what am I trying to say here? 
What am I trying to say here? Um, hmm, 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 hmm. Okay, so yeah, like I don't have I don't have two monitors anymore. That's the whole point of why I was talking with the monitor, uh, talking about the monitor. Excuse me, about about the monitor. Why was I talking about my monitors? It's because like I can't, I don't have two monitors anymore, for the moment. I'm broke. I work. I mean, I I work a job. I work. I work. I have a job. Right, but still can't afford myself another monitor. But then again, if I stop going out and stop drinking, maybe, oh, maybe I could afford it. Uh, but oh well. Um, look at that over there. What's what the hell is that? That's like a cave spawner. What the fuck is that? Is it? It's just cave spiders. Okay, okay, okay. It's cute, but it's it's lit, so it can't. It can't spawn because it's lit. Okay, cool, cool enough. So I got a bit of wood, and um, uh, yeah, that's all that noise. That's cool. Um, yeah, so like uh, the video that I'm trying to make. Uh, so like, really, I need to find some sheep actually, because if I don't find any sheep, I'm gonna freaking die at night because I won't. So let's head in this direction. I don't know how long the, the Badlands area, the Mesa biome, lasts for. I don't know how long it's going to last for. I don't know how far it's going to stretch. Uh, my best bet is actually this way. Where I'm going to potentially find some sheep. But, you know, I don't want to lose that area with the Mesa biome over there. Because that was really lucky. Like, I actually spawned right... And I didn't pre-select... You saw it. Like, I didn't pre-select the seed. So, yeah, um, I didn't pre-select the seed, so you, it, that was pretty lucky. That was pretty lucky to get a Mesa biome right off the bat. So I got a couple of apples on me, well, four apples on me. Uh, I'm going to try to find some sheep, but I don't, I don't freaking know. There's got to be some sheep around here. Oh... I think so. I think, yeah. Found some sheep. Get up some of that shit right there. Okay, I don't want to get too distracted. I need, I, need, I need to go get those sheep. I hope you all enjoy this video and find it, uh, this format of video, to be moderately interesting. A commentary. A commentary in the, in the, in the sense there. In a sense where I'm actually commentating and trying to be an entertainer of sorts and try to be uh, entertaining. Okay, so, oh, well, look, we've uh, found ourselves uh, an ocean here. I don't know, that looks interesting. That might be a nice place to build in because the Mesa biome will be a cool place to set up a, like a... I don't know, I've always liked to build Hollywood mansion style houses either in the side of a cliff like there or in the side of a cliff like a mesa biome especially i've done that in my well i used to have this sapio channel of mine with minecraft content and i had a burnout at one point and well long and short of it is that i the long and short of it is that this is my second channel actually and yeah it's my second channel, but this channel is a lot bigger now than the uh, first channel I started, which uh, initially only had like six subscribers. Now I have 54 subscribers. It's not too bad, but you know, I, I, why am I getting this wood? Like I need to do something. <laughs> I need to do like get stone. Okay, so we'll get some stone and then soon, we, soon enough we should be set up with something, um, Something. I really like this ocean view over here. It looks uh, kind of cool. Let's. I don't know. Let's make a little thing over there. On. Um, I don't know. I need to have access to wood, though. I need to have access to wood. So what I'm gonna do. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make myself a crafting table for first time. 
And then we're going to make ourselves a boat. Pardon me one moment while I check a, a text message. It could be from a boss. It could be from someone who I don't know. Let me just check that out. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Uh, yeah, that's really annoying when you're making a video and then you all of a sudden get a text message, but it's just some spamming garbage. It was just spam. Anyway, so I actually want to start my base over here, over there, I guess, I guess, right? Because there's going to be trees over there. I need to, I need trees to start something, a house of some kind, but we have this, this whole, we have this whole ocean opening over here and, uh, well, that could be interesting. So, uh, excuse me for the random cuts, uh, sometimes I get uh, little interruptions. Now, I need to quickly set up a bed to sleep. Alright, so with the uh, sleeping done, first night out of the way, I'm going to now... Uh... Yes, okay, so I have a... Ha ha <laughs> I've uh... Now I've just had a quick look around. It's uh, it's it's okay. Okay, excuse me if I'm like a little bit discombobulated. Like my folks just came back home, and like whenever I have to record with people in the house, it just fucking throws me off so bad. Like you have no idea how annoying that is. I guess we'll turn it into an ASMR video because of all the damn whispering I have to do. I don't know, I don't wanna I don't wanna fucking whisper to you guys. This is not some fucking ASMR shit. No, but you have to understand it's not It's not the best. And, well, there we have it. We have our first iron that we've discovered. That's good. Now, uh, oh, Jesus Christ. That's really bad. I don't want to fall in there. Wait, let's grab this up. Safe as we may. Alright. That way I don't have to die trying to get iron, that's good. Alright, so I'm back. Uh, just quickly fast forwarded through this little part here of uh, digging down to Y12. Now, uh, I can continue to uh, mine in different directions. Um, I don't know, like, do I need, necessarily need to make this into a complicated mining setup? I don't know yet. However, I, I don't know, like, uh, I just wanted to say, like, I, I'm drinking my beer, and then, like, I'm trying to record, and, like, I freaking choked on my beer, and, like, now I can't even sound normal, because I just choked on my beer, so if I sound weird, that's why I don't sound quite myself right now, I'm, like, choke, I, I'm, like, my throat is, like, full of something, yeah. Full of choked up beer, I guess, if you will. It's kind of gross and annoying. But with the magic of editing, you don't hear me coughing and choking over myself. <laughs> That's great. 
Okay, so as you all know, uh, the redstone that I just found here, I'll have to wait until I get uh, a tool made out of iron. Well, I guess the only uh, thing to do now is to dig ourselves a location here where I can uh, do little shits like um, utility station type stuff, you know, like the crafting table and the furnace. Okay. So, now I can uh, cook up this, uh, oh wait a minute, um, I, I've actually not found any coal going all the way down this uh, thing, so I'm just going to actually uh, make a bit of charcoal, that'll be good, I'll be right back with you when I've uh, cooked up that iron ore, and I can finally mine up some stuff and I don't know uh, I guess I'm gonna also um, think about what I'm actually gonna do next because I don't want to be kind of boring about this whole video alright so as it turns out if you're uh, also trying to while uh, while I'm trying to say is like while my uh, stuff is cooking up in the furnace I wanted to also say that you can kind of just kind of probe for caves here and there actually there's a cave right around here if I'm correct uh, I want to probe for this cave because I'm going to look for iron and the iron is going to be really useful. Hopefully, hopefully this will be a proper size cave. So let's just uh, wait for that lava to, uh, to go away and with the magic of editing, alright. So all right, so <laughs> we have a creeper uh, coming after us. Um, okay, that's that was good enough. Uh, we used an axe on him. So anyway, so uh, I managed to find uh, some of this coal, uh, coal and uh, the iron that I was looking for. A bit more iron is going to be useful, uh, as it always is, to have uh, the iron that we need. Now I am playing in Minecraft 1.16.1. Uh, some of the mechanics in the game are probably going to change at some point, but uh, let's uh, continue with this version of Minecraft and let's try not to be discombobulated by the fact that... Oh wait, that's a creeper or something. Uh, um, uh, yeah, there's a creeper. Okay, so like what I'm trying to say is like let's try not to be too discombobulated by the fact that uh, Mojang is constantly bringing up updates and, well, those updates are kind of disturbing in a way because like you never get to get used to the game like, thank you just die already bye <laughs> okay so like i'm trying to say is like my uh, mojang keep coming up with uh, so many updates and the updates are coming up rather quickly uh it's kind of hard to uh follow and to really get an idea of what's constant in minecraft and what's not <clears throat> like iron farms like, iron farms are just... I don't know. I have no clue how to make an iron farm at the moment in the game. I think they're broken. I'm pretty certain they're broken. And, yeah. But we'll look into that later in the series. Uh, later in the series, if I can make a iron farm, that would be cool. But, I, uh, I again, I have no promises for me. Anyway, let's get back to where I was. Uh, this is our little staircase area here. And uh, I'm just gonna block this off so no creeper kind of walk. And like I can see where the cave entrance is, but you know, it's just gonna be blocked off so I don't get snuck up on by any wandering creepers. Uh, that's good. Okay, so. Here is the iron that I uh, put away a bit going to next uh, cook up some of this iron here a uh, more iron of course um, but let's uh, also get uh, this these tools going here and while I'm at it I'm actually gonna dig this whole thing out which I'm going to place my chest down here the bonus chest that I got initially. 
so we can place safely some of our items here and uh, if we die or whatnot we won't we won't lose everything we'll have some some backup and now I can finally mine up this uh, redstone. Ah, great. Okay. So, we can also mine up some of this gold here, which is great. Unless you mine up the gold without the appropriate tool, it's not going to work. Alright, so I'm just going to proceed to do a little bit of off-camera work, because a lot of this stuff is going to be uh, a bit long. It's going to take a while doing the whole mining deal so I'll be right back with you guys all right so I found some uh, diamonds here uh, that's good as you can see it's the first time I found uh, these diamonds here uh, only th okay three three four good four how many more I don't think there's any more Okay, so that's our first diamonds that we got, four diamonds. Now, I'm not going to turn those diamonds into a pickaxe, unfortunately. I'm actually going to, uh, excuse the background noise. I'm going to, uh, what the background noise? What the background noise of those damn, uh, zombies going, Ugh. But, uh, what I'm trying to say is that, uh, these diamonds are actually going to go into my first enchantment table. And then later, I'll make a diamond pick once I'm ready. But for the moment, I'm going to have to continue with uh, garbage tools uh, for a little while longer. So yeah, as you all know in Minecraft, it's uh, there's a whole little process to this whole deal of uh, getting things. You gotta get the thing to get the thing to get the thing. So, without further ado, I'm just gonna think over what I'm actually gonna do in this in the rest of the episode because I have no idea. I don't know. I got diamonds. What else to do? I don't know. Mine a whole bunch. Oh. Excuse me. Yeah, I don't know. Mine a whole bunch? Uh, mine a whole bunch is good, but I was I was actually thinking of uh, building something on the surface area. Because, I don't know, um... Oh my god! We found diamonds again! What the frick? You just saw that, guys. Okay, so I can make diamond pick and the enchantment table. Well, not quite, because I don't have the full... A set of bookshelves so I won't be able to get full enchantments on that stuff and anyway I need to have the levels for it but that's not too bad it's not that's not too freaking bad I'm really surprised that I managed to find that so uh, without further ado I guess we're gonna go back up to the surface and do stuff I don't know what I'm gonna do uh, probably build something I don't know uh, we have the Mesa biome so if I want terracotta I have oodles of terracotta that I could uh, go mine up and make a, a, ni a nice base out of terracotta maybe maybe we'll see I'll be right back Jesus Christ I don't know what the hell is wrong with me but I keep finding diamonds I don't think there's anything wrong with that right <laughs> um, but oh my god that is terrifying let's dig around this shit because I'm scared that I'm gonna like, see, like, I dug through here the first time, and I had no idea that there was diamonds on the side over here. How many diamonds? I've got 15 diamonds. It's crazy. Let's try to get this stuff up without it burning up. Thank you. Okay. Again, like I said, we're, we're gonna we're gonna go back up to the surface and uh, do stuff. I don't freaking know. <laughs> I'm just really glad I got all those diamonds. 18 diamonds. So, before going up to the surface, I uh, decided to organize my inventory a little bit over here. I'm gonna need to cut down some trees and probably replant a bit. I, I don't know what to do. Um, I'll bring that sapling. However, um, the uh, sugar cane, I'm gonna need a bit more sugar cane, but that's what will be when I get there. Uh, so, actually, I'm gonna probably do a bunch of exploration on the surface of the world. I have my bed with me. So, I'm pretty much ready. It's just, like, again, like, I've been organizing some of my stuff here. i got some meat here, gold cooking up, and some iron. I'm not going to touch the iron too much. I'm actually going to put away most of the iron, bring some stone with me, because I'm going to be mostly relying off of some garbage tools, just because I'm a cheapo. 
and I think we're pretty much good to go to the surface now. So here we are at back at the surface. Uh, I'm going I'm gonna <laughs> get uh, myself a bit of wood, and I'm actually gonna just clear off this whole island, I guess. At the same time, I'm also probably going to plant the trees back, though you know, because I don't I just don't want to have to go all the way out over there those places and you know have to run super duper far to go get stuff. Also, another thing I want to do is build a house with like a a water uh, water uh, like a bubble column bubble column. That's exactly what I want with a big drop down to the down to my mine area and like uh and eventually like uh uh what you uh, i also want a beacon of course but <laughs> i just started so that's not gonna happen right away um so for uh, starters i'm actually gonna also make myself a chest here just to contain some uh, potential items that I may have on the surface here. I don't know. Like I was saying, uh, I want to make myself like this whole deal with uh, uh, a bubble column. We'll need to go to the nether when, when we're ready for that. But some of these saplings here are coming down. Let's plant a few trees. And I'm actually going to explore some of that desert, hopefully. And I'm, I'm also... Um, uh, like I was trying to say, I like, hopefully we'll find a desert temple, but what I was going to also say was that... Um, fuck, what am I even trying to say? Hopefully I'll find a desert temple over there. I guess that's basically what I was trying to say. I don't know, I get scatterbrained sometimes. Though. I have that problem. Uh, you'll have to excuse me for that. Anyway, uh, so let's uh, go. Well, let's go exploring. I have my bed, so it's good. If anything gets really long and boring, I'm probably going to uh, cut out some parts with uh, editing, as I usually do. And uh, I'm actually recording this video, but like recording the video, but I'm gonna probably upload it next week. I'm not sure because I need to have enough time to record. All of the gameplay and the stuff I find that that it will it will be a much better video if I take my time to make it a nice video an hour long vi a nice hour long video record uh, what am I trying to say um, basically a nice relaxing video is uh, more interesting than uh, some garbage uh, thrown thrown apart video Plus, I'm not too thematic, thematic about. I'm not too thematic about how I do my content now. I'm just doing a random video. This is kind of a random video, but it's also for fun. So, if you enjoy this kind of style of content, then don't forget to leave a like, comment, or subscribe to my channel. But without uh, further ado, let's continue. Uh, having uh, yeah, so there's uh, all of these. I don't think I'm gonna get cactus yet. Oh yeah, and there's the mesa biome over there. You see, I don't know if you guys are understanding where this is all situated in my map. Yeah. Uh, over there, yeah, over there is the uh, mesa biome. But I'm not, I don't think I'm gonna rush into that place yet. Hopefully in this desert I can find myself desert temple. Thank you. <laughs> I'm kind of low on meat. <laughs> That's so bad. I'm killing bunnies. But, uh, yeah. Oh, there's a shipwreck over there. Let's go. S oh, and the desert temple. Like I was looking for. But I am, like, legit low on food, so. You know. It can't be that bad killing some bunnies when you need food. Now watch the fuck out for creepers when you go down these places here. 
There can be creepers, there can be anything really. And uh, especially creepers. Because they can sneak up on you, and like when you're digging down this whole thing to get to the treasure, you can just as much get snuck up on by a, a creeper and die. Pretty much die. You're, you're gonna die, you know. You're gonna die if you don't light up the whole deal. I don't know. You don't, have, you don't absolutely have to light it up, but, you know. I can hear bunnies. Yeah, I can hear bunnies. Okay. Let's... Just in case a bunny was to pr <laughs> You know what? I just don't want a bunny to hop down here. You know, randomly. I just don't want a bunny to hop down randomly down here and uh, press and uh, activate that pressure plate. All right, the pressure the pressure plate is deactivated. Phew! Uh, now I can I don't know, perhaps some of this stuff here. The bones are useful. Uh, string is also useful, I guess. And uh, golden apple is okay. Oh, we found more diamonds. That's great. A saddle. That's good. Um, and we got some books here. Infinity. Quick charge. That is garbage. There's in Minecraft. There's books that people like literally do not use. Like, I've never used that quick charge. Quick charge. What's that for? I think that's for arm, uh, arming up or like charging up your bow as fast as. Faster, faster, I think, right? I'm not sure. It could be that. It could be something else. Okay, so that was done. <laughs> done safely. Without dying. Now I want to go see that shipwreck. We got some uh, diamonds out of that. That was cool. We'll probably get more diamonds out of the shipwreck, honestly. I'm just trying to situate myself. Where where the hell am I? Yeah, the shipwreck is over this way. So here is the shipwreck. I'm gonna like try to cut through this thing and see. Oh, yeah, emeralds. Got some emeralds. It's cool enough. I won't even get those nuggets. Eh? Eh? I'll loot them here, like. What I'm gonna do, I'll leave them like this in this form. And if I come back and I really need them, I don't know. Maybe I'll get them. Who knows? So there's this whole deal here. And if I go down a bit. And this seems to be the lower hull. The lower hull of this thing. I don't think I'm gonna get anything more out of that. Oh, well, not on that side. So now, I'm going to continue exploring and uh, I'm probably gonna do a bit of this exploration off camera. Actually, I need, I, like, I need to just go gather items like these uh, sugar canes, as much of them as I can, and I'll be right back with you guys. Now, while exploring, I've uh, happened to find some of these uh, turtles. Ah, you know what I'm actually gonna do? Let me uh, dump something here, real quick. We're gonna get some uh, seagrass. Is this the seagrass? No, that's not the seagrass. Oh, wait, it's true, you need shears. You need shears, however... Excuse me. However, we can, we can do it. We can, all we need to do. Uh, what am I trying to do? <laughs> I need shears. I need shears, I got the shears. Now, what I'm gonna show you is that you can actually do these guys. That's great. Uh, my inventory's full, goddammit. Thank you.
Alright. So, with the seagrass, I should be able to breed these, uh... Come on. Come here. Come here. <laughs> so now... Come on. Yes. There we go. They'll, they'll breed. That's good. Uh, that's good. Okay. So I'll come back for their eggs at some point, if I have soap touch. But for the moment, I'm going to just dump this on the ground. What did I just throw? I just threw my bed. No, that's not good. Uh, okay. So anyway, my inventory is starting to get pretty damn full. I think I'm going to end up heading home anyways, because... I just can't continue without uh, dumping some of my inventory. All right, guys, uh, we're back at the uh, base. Uh, I dumped some of the items in my invent into my chest. I mean, okay. So next course of action would be just for me to screenshot my coordinates here. And now, now that I've screenshotted my coordinates, I can. Uh, uh, excuse me. Uh, <laughs> I can now find uh, the location. I was like fumbling on my keyboard there for a sec. Uh, I can find this location. Why do I need to do that? Because, well, I'm gonna go explore a bit and explore some more. Actually, now that my inventory's empty, I'm gonna go explore some more and try to get the uh, leather that I need or a village. Or a village. Why, why would I want to find a village? Well, because I might find bookshelves there could find bookshelves I think that's still an occurrence in the game where in the villages you can find uh, the bookshelves however for uh, the sake of simplicity I think I'm actually just gonna build a little bit I'm just gonna make the bookshelves myself out of the raw materials uh, that I need to uh, for, that, for that to uh, occur um, now I swear, I swear there was like, um, cows somewhere. Now we're heading towards the mesa biome, that's all cool and stuff, but... Oh, this is where the cows are. Okay. So in this local vicinity, I'm thinking of people... <laughs> I can't even speak. I'm just trying to say, I want to keep two cows. Two cows. For breeding, these two cows here will stay for breeding. The rest will be wiped out. So I've just got uh, 45 leather to get. I gotta get 45 leather. Okay. Because uh, the 45 leather is the uh, actual quantity of leather, leather you need. And you need to have 270 um, whatchamacallit, freaking Man, I get so scatterbrained when I'm recording. I'm just trying to say, you need 270 sugar cane. Sugar cane. Yeah. So you need 270 sugar cane and 45 leather to get the full enchantment table. It's, it's basically the whole... The whole deal. That's what I was trying to say. But it, but through the magic of editing, you don't hear me fumble as much. Oh, good. <laughs> so, I, uh, yeah, I'll be right back with you guys. I've got a whole ton of cow killing to do. So, I have been uh, doing quite a lot of cow killing to uh, go and uh, fetch me uh, 45 leather, which is what I've got right here. 45 leather. And I've also found a village. I'm gonna do a bit of trading. Let's uh, have a look at this uh, here trading huh? um, that we could do. Uh, I'm gonna steal all their bales and stuff like that, and you know, that's just how you do in Minecraft. <laughs> and then uh, we should get a few emeralds. I don't, I don't know. Uh, really, what I should be looking to do with these guys is to eventually make. Uh, trade outpost of some kind, or um, get get more. Oh Jesus! Like there's so much here, so much hay. Um, I'm saying like, oh my God, these guys are making so much noise. Uh, I'm just trying to say without being so scatterbrained is that 
Uh, yeah, I would really like to make a uh, a trading uh, a trading thing with villagers. That'd be cool. But now I'm just gonna trade with the basic villagers that there. Are. There's a lot of villagers in this town. There's a lot of villagers there. Look. Well, you can't see right now, but damn, there's a lot. So there's a lot of specimens <laughs> for my at my disposal. Oh Jesus! It all popped out of my inventory. Thank you. Oh Jesus. So uh, yeah, guys, I was uh, I was I had to cut the recording because uh, um, complications with uh, the whole people living here with me kind of deal. Okay, so this uh, whole village is uh, really interesting, but uh, we gotta get back home now. So I'm gonna uh, get back home, and uh, we I don't know I uh, have to do stuff uh, like I was actually going I was trying to get the enchantment table going. And home is like back that way, so I gotta run back. So I will catch you all back over there. Alright, so guys, also before I head home, I also decided to come back and trade with this uh, villager here. Because I, I do tend to get scatterbrained and forget about stuff. But, of course, like I did, I uh, just took their crops and I got a few carrots, a potato, and uh, some beetroot seeds and, you know, that kind of stuff. So that's basically that. Let's uh, let's head back home. So I am back now, uh, back home. Uh, so we're gonna probably uh, plant some of this uh, sugar cane that I got. Uh, I'm just gonna plant it all across the uh, shoreline, as to uh, create as much of it as I can, because I don't know. I I don't really have a farm plan for this whole deal at the moment but uh, the more of it I make the more the closer I'm gonna get to an enchantment table with the uh, with the whole uh, with the whole you know bookshelves however I'm probably gonna keep like 12 behind just for keeps and then I'm gonna plant the rest I'm gonna plant the rest so I'll be right back with you guys just I guess we'll fast forward this So, I am now back, uh, so the whole uh, deal with uh, keeping the sugar cane behind was uh, for me to make a few samples of paper here, so that I can make myself a book, right? And uh, actually I'm gonna have to get a few more, uh, just one more leather, to get one more leather. Uh, yeah, later I'll do that, but uh, for the moment I'm just looking to craft the, oh, and I need the obsidian. Shit. So, uh, let's go get the obsidian, I guess. Alright, so I'm now down in my mine. I'm going to have to select three diamonds to make myself a uh, diamond pick. And uh, we're gonna mine up some obsidian and, you know, that's uh, how it goes, right? <laughs> oh, shit. And I need, I need a bucket of water. I'll be right back with you guys in a moment. I just gotta go back up at the surface and get that. Alright, so I don't want to pretend like making uh, obsidian is the most exciting thing ever, but the trick with making obsidian is that you place your water bucket down somewhere up high, and then it will turn all of the, uh, all of the stuff here into uh, obsidian, right? So it kind of protects you. You can just mine down like this. This is this is kind of how and right. So like as you can see, like I didn't go into the lava and it instantly turned it into obsidian, protecting me while I'm trying to mine this shit. So I'll be right back with you guys. All right. So uh, also another trick you can do with the whole lava stuff is um, you can uh, create like yourself a a. Uh, <clears throat> 
Hey, you can create yourself a lava cast where you're just basically gonna create this spot where you're gonna pour water over the top and then it's gonna turn it into obsidian and you can safely mine it without potentially falling into lava still. You know, even though you're even though mo you're, <clears throat> even though you're mostly protected, you you still could have that occurrence. So usually I just place the lava in like that and just get it one bucket at a time and just place it in. All right. So once you have a full uh, lava pool here, I guess you can just uh, pour the water in like that, and then you basically get. Uh, you get to mine safely the obsidian, or it's safer, I guess. It's a little safer. You can do it this way, or not. It's not a speed. It's not very speedy, by all accounts. It's not, but it's good. It's uh, it's alright. And also, I'll show you another thing. <clears throat> all right, so uh, you can also uh, make yourself a uh, nether portal in this uh, particular formation, I guess, in this uh, technique. Where you just grab one bucket <coughs> of lava and then take the water like that and just turn it to obsidian and get yourself an easy, fairly easy nether for you. And that you don't really have to... Well, I do have a... I do have, in fact, a diamond pickaxe and I could use my obsidian in that form, but I prefer to keep my obsidian that I have in my inventory as much as possible and then just have this nether portal that I'm going to make out of uh, lava buckets as you can see. So now as you can see I have everything I need for the uh, enchanting table. Now it's just a matter of uh, shift clicking that into my inventory and there you go. Um, uh, what else? Yes, so That's the enchantment table done. I'm going to save that enchantment table for the next episode where I will continue with the uh, uh, Enchantment room as it were um, I Guess for a bonus we're gonna head over to the nether, but I'm not gonna do too much in this episode uh, Because I'm uh, it's already quite a long episode so far um Okay, so I need some flint. Uh, I guess I need to get that. Alright, so here we are finally at the portal, ready to light it up. So let's light it up. And uh, yeah, I'm pretty much ready. I'm not I'm not super heavy on gear. I'm kind of light on gear. Let's see uh, what kind of generation we get here. Oh, another fortress right off the bat. That's pretty awesome. We get a nether fortress right off the bat. That's pretty awesome. Let's uh, hide from that gas over there. So let's... Uh... Oh shit! I don't want to look at the enderman. That's a very bad idea. Very bad. No, don't look at the enderman. Um, we have a portal here that I can... Loot, I guess. Let's look at what's in the chest. Okay, garbage, I guess. I guess it's garbage. Mostly, uh, mostly garbage. Okay, not too bad. But we still we found another fortress uh, right next to. Oh, uh, well, it's that way. So let's uh, head over that way. Just gotta get through this uh, garbage here. This biome. Try not to look at the Enderman. Whatever you do, don't look at the Enderman. I'm actually kind of terrified right now. Because, like, I'm not sure if my golden armor is going to actually protect me that much. Uh, it's garbage uh, in terms of the armor rating, but... Uh, no, that's not why I'm wearing it. 
I'm wearing it to stop. Oh, look. So we got that this episode. The, a terrible fortress um, advancement. That's great. Now we better watch out for these uh, guys here. The whatchamacallem. The wither skeletons. Now I'm not here mainly for wither skeletons. I'm just exploring a bit. But uh, it's nice that we have a nether fortress right next to where I start. That's really lucky. It's really good. So actually, we're going to head back over to the overworld because I'm not ready to... Uh, <laughs> I'm not ready to explore too much over here. So that's not too bad. Not too bad, um, I guess. Sorry. Right. So I'll catch you all in the overworld. Alright guys, I'm back at the overworld, but I've uh, done quite a lot. I've uh, recorded this uh, episode over two days, and uh, yeah, um, yeah, I'm gonna take the time to uh, edit this and uh, throw this up on YouTube, and uh, you know, uh, I think it's long enough as it is the episode. Uh, if you want to like, if you would like me to make longer videos, then le let me know if that would if that is the case. But, uh, anyway, uh, until next time, I've been Sapio, I uh, bid you all farewell.